Beware of beauty bargains. That's the timeless tip coming from some local medical professionals tonight. Doctors say as more patients undergo cosmetic procedures and plastic surgery, ads offering two-for-one deals are increasing, and that could spell danger. 17's Tisha Lewis in studio tonight with more on why, when it comes to going under the knife, cheaper is not always better. Deal or no deal, you may have heard or seen the advertisements touting liposuction, breast augmentation, and much more for the price of one. But is it really a deal? Some local doctors say if you want to enhance your natural beauty, you may have to pay the price. Just $2,900 for a breast enlargement. Commercials advertising cosmetic procedures and plastic surgery are taking over the airwaves. Pay only $2,900 for a breast enlargement. $2,900 for any three areas of liposuction or just $3,900 for a tummy tuck. And that includes everything. We tried calling the company placing this ad, but there was no answer, not even a recording. Local medical professionals have a stern warning. Those types of advertisements really cheapen plastic surgery as a profession. Um, plastic surgery is not a drive-through type of business. It's an extremely uh, complex profession, and we go through a lot of training to do these procedures. Some non-surgical procedures like Botox and others where patients go under the knife. All the way up to breast augmentation, reconstruction, tummy tucks, liposuction, facelifts, everything. Christy Elms underwent well, breast I, augmentation I last year. I went through my whole life not having breasts and it was really an insecurity for me and so after I had it done it made a big difference. I mean it's just boosted my self-confidence. I can wear the cute little shirts now and I feel more like a woman. Insecurity combined with a too good to be true bargain is what some fear could prompt future patients to place themselves in danger. Just because they, the price is lower doesn't mean you're going to be getting anything that's better or the correct job or something that's necessarily safe for you. Elms could have cut the cost of her surgery had she followed the advertisement we listened to, but instead she picked her doctor based on word of mouth. Some say that's the best way when it comes to plastic surgery. Here are some tips well, I, doctors I, I, recommend. Make sure you check your doctor's credentials. You want a doctor trained in surgery and not just surgery, someone who has had extensive training in plastic surgery. But not everyone wants to go under the knife. Patients, they come here like merely asking for like, you know, all these procedures. Uh, they want to look better. And, you know, since we have uh, tons of advancement in the medicine recently, patients, they want to look good and they want to feel good. There's a whole world of cosmetic non-surgical procedures. Botox was roughly right around $500. I think it's like $10 a unit and sort of depends on how much the doctor gives you. Botox is a 10-minute process where tiny injections are made to have a large effect, helping eradicate wrinkles. I've done it only once and I've done it for a month, but I will continue to do it. The procedure doesn't involve splicing and dicing, but when it comes to choosing a doctor, it's just as important. Unfortunately, there's still a lot of like medical spa that they get this procedure done without a direct physician supervising. Um, it's not really recommended. Doctors say the bottom line is when it comes to your body, there's no deal or bargain. I usually, you know, tell people don't choose your surgeon based on price. You might have to pay a pretty penny, but in the end, you could avoid damages that could last a lifetime. Some local doctors say many of the two-for-one deals you may hear about are coming from offices based outside of Kern County. We can't even get through to a person when dialing the number on the radio we found. Doctors say the danger is if something goes wrong, it could be tough to track down the doctor and virtually impossible to fix the problem. Jim. All right, thank you very much, Tisha. Just a picture-perfect day here in the Golden Empire. Lori Wallace will join us live with your Memorial Day.